hello guys in this video i'll show you how to backup and restore all your iphone data transfer files from your iphone to pc and from your pc to your iphone backup your icloud backup and restore iMessages and much more using just one app phone 2. now the first thing you're going to do is head to our browser and download phone 2. Now I'm going to provide the link in the video description so you can head directly to this page and download. We're going to click on free download. Now you can choose to use this software for free and you should be able to access most of the features. After downloading, you can run the installer from your download folder and then proceed with the prompt, install now. Now after installing, we can click on enjoy now and it should load phone 2. Okay, so the first step after the installation is to connect your iPhone using a USB cable. And then click on trust on your phone, enter your passcode to confirm. So you can see my phone is now connected. From here we can use the data explorer. We can copy photos, music, ringtones, videos, contacts, and even our messages. Here are some of my photos which I can easily just select. And then you can see export to computer, which is going to save it to my computer. I can save it wherever I want. In this case, I want to save it to my download folder and then export. This way you can easily save files from your phone to your PC. On my PC, you can see under photos, this is the photo I, this is the photo I copied just now. This same way you can copy videos and any file you want to copy basically. Let's go back, you can see my iCloud. From here you can back up and restore from iCloud and also sync. So you can sign in if you want that. Here you can click on phone backup and then we can go with a full backup or a selective backup. If you want to change your phone and transfer data from one phone to another, you can use the full backup option and then backup everything. But if you want to backup just few things, you can go with selective backup and backup for maybe your photos or any one specifically. We could backup, let's say, just music and ringtones and then start backup. And the backup is complete. We can click on view here. And you can see the last backup we did and the size as well. The ringtone and music section is empty, so I don't have any file backed up. Now you can restore your iPhone backup by clicking on the restore button here. And it is going to restore any data you backed up. So if you don't have storage on your iPhone, you can back up your data here to your PC. And then if you get a new iPhone with much storage or you want to transfer the files back, you can simply just connect your iPhone and restore the backup. Now most of the features of these two are free. But if you want more access, then you can upgrade to get more access. They also have other features like WhatsApp backup where you can backup and restore your WhatsApp data. We all know transferring WhatsApp data or WhatsApp chats from one iPhone to another is usually stressful and sometimes it doesn't even work. But this way you can easily transfer WhatsApp or backup WhatsApp from one iPhone to another. There is WhatsApp and there is also WhatsApp business. Now, if you click on the buy now option, you can see the pro license for a year is $39.95 and you get access to this software for 5 pieces. There is also a lifetime license for $59 and you don't have to pay for this software ever again for 5 pieces. There is also a pro unlimited lifetime license for $79.95 for unlimited pieces and unlimited devices and this is a lifetime access meaning you would always get access to this software. Now this is quite cheap for what it offers and I would recommend you check this software out if you have any need to backup and transfer data from your iPhone to your PC or from your PC to your iPhone. I'm going to leave a link in the video description so you can click and download phone too. If this video was helpful, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.